Yeah, man, I have a workshop downstairs, you know. I teach you to build speaker boxes and teach them about electronics thing, you know. Why I'm doing that is because I care. That is why I'm doing that, because I could have gone somewhere else and doing something else with my time, you know, or traveling in a different country. But I find that it's important. This building is, I live in this community for 45 years, going 50 years. And this is the only building of its kind that I've ever seen in the Ola Lambert. There's no other building like this building, right? And what this building does, it gives the youth a breathing space that when you come from school, you, we know that our children are not going to stay in our house when they come from school. They're going to go out on the street, right? So this place gives a breathing space for the youth, youth and youth to come around here. We have Court 7, Asha, that record all the youth them over at Court 7. We have Shenis who just speak, who is doing a good work if you come here and sat down every day, you see youth dancing doing formation of different dancing and acting and everything, you know. Sometimes the youth round here, they write their own play and they play it out outside. And it's beautiful, you know what I mean? So what we ask for is, is support. We want support from people, you know. We don't just want people to come and talk and some politician who look for just turn up and try and use it. Because we don't know that, right? We don't see that the, every, every politician come and say good things, but never manage to do nothing when just talk and go. You understand? So, I'm saying to parents who children are coming around here, this is a good place for your children to come. Because one thing, there's discipline around here. Because there's no youth can come around here and think that it can bad up anything. Except you wouldn't be coming around here. You'd get dismissed. So, we, we speak to the youth, we try and speak to them about discipline, about love. Why are we teaching them something, you know what I mean? We still teach them about love, how, how we grow up with the brother and with sister and, you know, with cousin, loving, how we love each other and fight for each other and thing, you know what I mean? So I see that this place is a very important place for we to hold on to, because we are doing something around here. Something very good is happening around here, you know what I mean? And I wish that some of the people here tonight could come and see some of the plays that these youngsters put on around here. And listen to some of the youngsters how they sing, you know? There's a lot of rapper and DJ and thing among here. And if you hear these youth rap and sing and do something, you'd be amazed, you know what I mean? So um, we ask for support, you know? We ask everyone to support this, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. We don't know where this is going from after today, you know, but we are here. If the ship sink, we're going to sink with it. You understand? We're not running away and going away, because we have to do something for the youth in the community, you know, because look what's happening on the street. One of the most serious things that happening on the street is that the elder people in the community know each other, but their children don't know each other. So that's one of the biggest things that we have in the community, you know. I know so much of the elders in the community, but I don't know their children, and their children don't know me, and my children don't know their children, and their children don't know my children. So they end up in the street fighting. And when we turn up now for pacify, the two side turn up, is somebody I know, and it's somebody who know me. You understand? So that's why this place is good. Because this is not only Lambert you'd come from, you know, you'd come from all over the place and come here. But no matter where they come from, it's the same discipline. Everyone who come here have to be the same with the same discipline. You understand? Except you have to go back out through the gate. So please, we ask them to support Brixton. Well, Anna call is Affley Works. Because Brixton base was, you know. This is Affley Works. And we who live here, we're not running and going anywhere. We will fight to maintain this place, you know? Because we know that what it is doing for our children. It's, it's keeping our children off the street for even five hours off the street, just sure that they are here. There are recording shooter in there. There's one up there, right? And there is recording shooter over court seven. So there's a lot of things going on around here, you know what I mean? And we have got a lot of internet that the youth can come around here and learn. And we want people who know about the internet who can come round here and give us a couple of hours to teach the youth, you know? 
put back something into the youth. All who know about the internet already and pass out, even two hours a evening, if you can put back round here, because there's a lot of youth don't know about the computer and the internet, you know? And it's not a lot of us round here that can teach all of them, so we need people who can volunteer and come in, see Shenies and say, yes, I can give two hours Wednesday, or I can give two hours Tuesday to teach the youth, you know what I mean? So that's all we beg, you know? We be here, so blessed love to everyone, you know, and thanks for your support, yeah?